So there are a number of operational advantages to using smart technologies. It obviously impacts upon the customer, uh, but it's also an operational tool as well. It's one of the interesting things. People think about smart metering, for example, and think about that's, that's about your customer relationship. But actually, smart meters are an operational tool as well. They tell you where your water is going. So once you start to put smart technologies into your networks, you start to understand what's going on in your network. One of the things that I often say, you know, when we're talking about smart technologies and smart networks, is I go, okay, look, you look at a treatment works and we know everything about that water up until it leaves the works. We can tell you the temperature, conductivity, how much chlorine there is, everything like that. Then it leaves the works and suddenly we're in a black hole of what's going on. And, you know, one of the things is I say, well, we have 300,000 sensors in our network that tell us if there's a problem. The trouble is, they're called our customers. And we don't like them ringing up and telling us there's something wrong. We should know before that. And that's one of the things that we're working to with smart technologies embedded within the network to be able to say before a customer is aware, we know first. And we can start to put things right before customers are even aware of problems. Traditionally, when people have done water testing on site, it's been a very laborious process, very time consuming. What the technology enables them to do is to do the test much quicker and get a quality of result and log it much easier and much simpler. So our meter talks with the results of the parameters to smartphones, to iPhones, to tablets, and then up to an iCloud. So it allows data storage and transfer onto customers' systems to be easily transferred. One of the things we're keen on is understanding how customers are using water. Uh, so we can, we can log their consumption, we can monitor what water they're using on a 15 minute basis, on a minute ba basis at, at, at times, and look at that. In that information and, and understand what's happening within a site, so we can we can see where there's waste, we can we can see where there's potential leaks, and and we can then offer uh, solutions to reduce consumption and get con control of it again.